This is what you call a wow kind of story because the governor of Illinois, Rod Blagojevich, who was accused of trying to get people to pay to play and is now embattled and is trying to uh, hold off impeachment, well, now he's going to hold a press conference today. And guess what? He's going to name who his choice is to replace Barack Obama. And that person is Illinois Attorney General Roland Burris to replace Barack Obama in the United States Senate. That is what we are expecting at 3 p.m. Eastern today. The appointment comes despite Democratic leaders, of course, in Washington saying that they would not recognize any move by Blagojevich to uh, appoint who he wants to fill the seat by Obama. Um, now, Burris, who is the former Illinois Attorney General, has made his interests known in this uh, Senate seat, but he was never seriously considered. He was not one of the people who was on uh, that list of names. Um, who people thought could get this potential replacement. Of course, this former Illinois Attorney General, Roland Burst, is an African-American, and he is the name that we are hearing that the governor of Illinois, Rod Blagojevich, will announce is his choice to replace Barack Obama in the U.S. Senate. We've got Lynn Sweet, of course, who is the Washington bureau chief for the Chicago Sun-Times, on the phone. And Lynn, first, your reaction. Well, I just uh, confirmed it, and I posted this on my blog. Um, what Rod Bogoyevich is doing, Nora, is an end run around everyone right now by appointing Roland Burris, who was the first African-American to win statewide office in Illinois, by the way. His first statewide post was Comptroller, where he served from 1983 to 1991. What's interesting now is this. He'll make the announcement uh Senator Harry Reid, the leader of the uh, Democrats in the Senate, had said he wouldn't accept an appointment from Rod Bogoyevich, but Burris is someone who has a very good reputation. He would have to uh, be in the position of saying why Burris shouldn't be accepted. Uh, the impeachment proceedings, by the way, are still going ahead. Uh, I don't see how this will derail them. Tell us a little bit more about Burris. A lot of people are not familiar with him who are not from Illinois. Who is he? Well, and he is a senior statesman in Illinois politics whose time, I say this respectfully, uh, has, has passed and he had been in political retirement. Um, he ran as, uh, as I said, he was the controller from 83 to 91. He was the Illinois Attorney General from 91 to 95. Nora, he ran and lost bids for the U.S. Senate and governor. Uh, he tried to uh, have a statewide, uh, you know, campaign that he could not pull off. And he thought he had a base in that, uh, two bases that he has in Illinois. Uh, he is from southern Illinois, and he, um, you know, is, is, had long been a major African-American office. Uh, he mm -hmm. is a real nice guy. Is he guy, close with Barack Obama? Do you know, is he, he is close not, with Barack Obama no, at all? Different generation. I'm, uh, he's not of the Obama generation. By the time Obama came to town, uh, he was already a high-ranking elected official. You know, Obama came on the scene in the early 90s mm -hmm. when he first you know, made his first trip to Illinois as a community organizer. So, he, you know, Obama was very junior to, you know, to Roland Burris at the time. Uh, Burris also comes out of uh, kind of the organized political democratic establishment in Chicago. He's not, mm. uh, you know, so he comes out of, I would have to say, the the daily Matt, Mike Madigan camp. And uh, for those, mm. again, who are listening who don't uh, know that, it's, you know, these are the names who are the remnants of the old machine. But he is a pretty respected guy. But the question would be, will he take this seat and intend to run for it in 2010? It is interesting, of course, as now we're learning Blagojevich is going to make this announcement publicly at 3 p.m. Eastern to appoint the former Illinois Attorney Governor, um, Attorney General, rather, Roland Burris, to this seat. Barack Obama was just the third African American to be um, elected uh, and to serve in the United States Senate since Reconstruction. So Roland Burris would be the fourth. Um, and, and that's and, very few African Americans who've served in the U.S. Senate. And go ahead, Lynn. Mm -hmm. And may I point out that out of those four, three of them then will have been from Illinois: Carol Mosey Braun, Barack Obama, and now Roland right. Burris. Absolutely. All right, Lynn Sweet. We're going to have more on this story, and of course, we are going to cover more of it live here on MSNBC. Big news today. It appears the governor of Illinois is going to make his appointment to fill Barack Obama's seat. It is another African-American, one who was not 
on the short list before. What does it all mean? We'll have more straight ahead here on MSNBC, the place for politics. <laughs> 